uh, for weekly one-on-one -on -one meeting. Mm, let me start with the thank you. Um, my personal base is I already sign up for satukancinta.com and uh, make query for list user by specific criteria. Um, business base is uh, the same from the previous. Um, and I don't really do much in this weeks. Uh, uh, so how about your search? How about your week? Is there any good news? Still looking for another developer. <laughs> yeah, the the merrier, the better. <clears throat> okay, uh, let's next to the next session. Scorecard is uh, uh, is yours. The rough review. We are on this quarter for uh, sign up, edit, and search um, for. Custom to uh, team member headlines. There's a new team member, uh, Razif and Maulana, and there's a new team leader too, Yaski, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> okay. Um, next, we got to do list. And just like what I said earlier, sign up and Grab KL query for list with specific criteria. Actually, one minute ago, <laughs> I tried to make a database dump with data generator. Yeah, that's nice. Do you make it uh, using MongoDB Compass or using GraphQL API? Uh, we come pass. Uh, are you able to create it using GraphQL? No problem. Not, not yet for create user. I'm um, not capable of doing that yet. Uh, so that will be next to do, yeah? So you make a GraphQL API to create user and also to yeah. modify. Okay, okay. That's my next print. Especially the value of type, but receive H. Oh, religion. The religion too. I have H, but on my user service. Religion. I, oh, there is only I, C, P, or T. That's my problem. I'm yeah, sorry. Uh, you should, you should uh, add that to the definition in uh, the TypeScript file, yeah? So if the TypeScript file is not complete, then you need to improve that or fix it. Hmm. Delete my collection first. So I can Maybe delete it. Yeah. Okay. Warning typo. Certainly. Question of user. Read database. User have to add data first. Wanna generate data for Christianity. Generate. Actually, H is a valid value, yeah. So you need to change actually the source code so that the complete list of religions should be accepted. Mm. Insert. Please on your next report, uh, please also uh, discuss mm. the tool that you use here mm. to automatically uh. assemble data. Yeah? Mm, okay. 
Let me try again. Because that is an interesting tool to save time, yeah, to generate sample data. <laughs> so I, I like that. So that's good. Very good. Hello, Assalamualaikum, Anki. How are you? We cannot see you yet. Yeah. Uh, okay, okay. So, um, this is for Fine User. I make uh, one query for Fine User. Uh, let me take a look to the function. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, so uh, let you guys introduce yourselves, okay? Uh, so Dimas, please introduce yourself to Anki, and Anki, please introduce yourself to Dimas. This Dimas Satria, you can call me Dimas, and I'm 21 years old. Um, oh. <laughs> so young. And, um, okay. Uh, yeah. Uh, and I am uh, on my last year on college. I'm from Unpad, Pajajaran University. My major is computer science. And yeah, I'm um, last year undergraduate student. How about you? Uh, I'm 24 years old. Mm. Uh, I'm graduate student from yes. Telecom University from informatics. <laughs> Already graduated. Yeah, uh, two years. Two years ago. Yeah, uh, two thousand and eighteen. Yeah. And you are twenty one. Twenty one years old. Twenty four. Yeah, twenty four. <laughs> okay. Okay. Nice to meet so you. So you, uh, bachelor. Bachelor student or? Come uh, again, I'm sorry. So, so you are a student on my last year on college. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, shall we continue, sir? Mr. Andy? Okay, okay. Um, so I'll build this query for fun user. I just uh, take only take three arguments uh, yet uh, gender, religion, and age. Nah, maybe this is my problem. Uh, I just uh, make it fast. I don't really think this is uh, effective, effective ways, effective algorithm. I, I think I'm just using if and if and if. So because this uh, uh, we have three for tiga pangkat atau masih masih Inggris Uh, what did you ask a question? Can you repeat? So, so well, this question, I, don't, uh, I, I should write this. Uh, with, um, I guess, but the the cafe. If I have the arguments we we want the age to be twenty one and to get a collection with the parameter of gender male and age 21. If I want to take another parameter, let's say religion, and the religion is Islam, 
we take it i. So um, I just have one collection, one one document with gender male, age 21, and religion one. And because I make a lot of else, else if if else, I can make like this, for example. So we have uh, age 21, religion Islam. We get another document for gender female. Uh, I think you got the point. Is there any comment for, for that? Okay, so this is very nice. Uh, I like that you have uh, done this and make several queries. Uh, mm -hmm. I agree with you that there should be a better way of doing it mm -hmm. because mm -hmm. uh, the combination of fields uh, to be filtered are static, mm -hmm. right? It's not mm -hmm. flexible uh, because we have a lot of fields and uh, mm -hmm. ideally it should be able to query any combination of all the fields, okay? Mm -hmm. All the important fields. Okay, but this is a good start. Uh, you can optimize the query mechanism later. Mm -hmm. but I would say for now, uh, it's uh, it's a good way if you can uh, demonstrate how to create a user and modify user for uh, next time. Okay. Okay. Uh, maybe this there is for my next sprint, my next week. I'll do that. I'll do create user and modify user. Create user maybe for just sign up. Yeah, sign up a query. And yes, modify user for if user setting or change their field. I will do that. The next. Okay. But, uh, uh, please uh, open MongoDB Compass so that Anki can also see uh, the kind of uh, data that we have here. So uh, we're gonna use MongoDB. Uh, this is. Uh, the database certainly PRD uh, and we have I just only have one collection name user and actually the user have a lot of fields in MongoDB schema we can see it has a lot of fields like ID, email uh, mobile number birthdates a lot of fields like 161 fields, uh, photo, and etc. And the collection also have another uh, collection, but I've, I'm not implemented yet. We have image employment school topic and another collection. This also um, like a second or support collection for the primary user collection itself. Uh, the For demonstration, uh, I'm just make a few fields like name, email, age, religion, and gender for testing. And I make data dump so you can try it, the query. Okay, thank you. So, uh, Anki, I, I'm showing you this is an example of uh, database in MongoDB that we use, and also how to use that database in MongoDB Compass and implement it as GraphQL API using, uh, we are using Node.js and NestJS here. So, the Code there, this was the code is written by Dimas. And actually, uh, I am still waiting for Kevin to join the meeting, but maybe okay. he's not here yet. Uh, actually, I would uh, love for him to show how it looks like in the front end yeah, using uh, mm -hmm. web. Yeah, but maybe if not now, then maybe next time. Okay.
I don't know. I really don't know why Kevin did not join the meeting because yesterday uh, he tell me that he will join the meeting. He informed me that he will join my meeting, but I don't know why. <laughs> It's not here. Okay, so Anki, uh, do you have any questions? Where is, where is Anki just left? Okay, Maybe. so since this is your meeting anyway, uh, do you have any, anything else to report or issues that you want to ask me? Uh, I have one problem actually. The query for find user on by ID. Mm, for example, I want to find my ID three. Name, name, but I'm sorry, ID. That is, that's, that's the bug. Uh, I'm trying to find the ID 14, for example, but uh, the query just giving me the first data, always the first data. So it's not find by ID yet. And I don't really know why, because from the, code itself id and find one uh, we got user service find one and actually this is a, a correct code it has to be a correct code but i have that bug find one by id Okay, so the the problem here is uh, okay, find one ID is number. Okay. Can you can you check whether the find one is actually giving a number or actually it's giving a string? Because from GraphQL to this, uh, it is it is actually a string. Maybe you can put like a console log before that and lock the type of the variable ID. Lock the type of the variable ID? Yes, because string and number is different, right? String and number. It has to be number, right? Because uh, we parse it in here. Pass integer ID. And in the database, is it uh, also? Uh, it's also a number. This, this is an integer, right? Okay, just, just do a console log, just to make sure, yeah. Okay. Console log. ID. It's better if you put something before the ID finding find one. Oh, okay. Like this. Okay, try it. Fourteen 
and please uh, also lock the type of the variable like how how i know the type you can use type of type of type of of like this how come again sir type of space id type of space id Type of is small. Type of like this. All small. Just like the one in the hint. See, there is also. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay, okay. You also put the ID there, not just type of. So, ID and also type of ID, lock, lock them both. And put some separator so they are not like uh, blended. Oh, okay. Yeah, you you need another space before people that die. Another space before tipe data, okay. Can I do this? Okay, try it. Have data number. Okay, now check uh, on the database. On the database. Hmm. Okay, should be correct here. Hmm. Find one. Can you try the find one is using ID explicitly instead of just giving the ID? Yeah, I already try like this and uh, it don't work it's also don't work it also doesn't work try uh, what the code I give in the chat Try, try what I give in the chat Maybe by using where. Maybe you need to use where yet. Maybe, yeah, maybe this will work. Anki said she has a power failure in her house. Power failure, oh, power failure. In Indonesia, we call it mati lampu, right? Still happening in 2020. <laughs> ah. Now we got it. I don't know the fine one. It's why weird why this happens, but at least yeah, at least it works now. Yeah, now we got it. What we want. Okay. 
so thank you sir <laughs> the graphql query for one get you sir done okay um mutation and modify Uh, my issue uh, was the previous one, the query for get one user, but we already have done, have solved it, actually, I just type it, uh, problems, issue, query. Already solve. By where? Okay. Uh, Let's go back to the to dos on five because I think you haven't uh, written a blog and published video, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, wh when do you plan to publish the video and uh, blog post? I always late for that of one video and <laughs> blog um maybe tomorrow maybe yeah maybe tomorrow waiting tomorrow yeah yeah uh, for weekly video and blog post maybe i just um get if you you have some i think you have some good content yeah to show mm -hmm. and uh yeah you can do at least you can do find find one also find criteria for collection and please also mention the auto generating of mm -hmm. data yeah okay. uh, they, are, they are good this one the generate data one uh, it's, it's good and uh, please describe how to use this okay. uh. Uh, for the video, um, yes, yes, yeah, yeah, for the, uh, yeah, the video, for the video, uh, do I, um, how can I put it? Do I have to make another source code for the video? Uh, the video is for yes, public just use what you have here. Oh, it's basically describing what you have done during the last week. Hmm. So the video is not for public consume. It's for yeah. mafia team consume. The video is public. Public, uh, but uh, uh, is it okay if we use this Miluf profile? Uh, it's okay. So. Uh, it's not like open sourcing the entire code base, right? Only some of the parts. And also because you are only using like sample data, there is no private information involved. So I think this is good. Okay. Hey. Sorry, I got Where you. Are? It's just a bit. Yeah, so it's okay. And uh, please, Publish to Lofia Team YouTube channel. Yeah. Okay, okay. So for the co conclude, for the conclude, uh, we have uh, my next screen. 
I have to make a GraphQL mutation for create user and notify user. And I also have to make a blog and video about it. Is there anything that I should do? Okay, I think uh, that is good. I would say that after you have done that, the next one would be uh, fine uh, with criteria, yeah? but with complex criteria. So I'm not using uh, if for different ones, but more about mm. flexibility on in combining the mm. fits. Mm. Okay, okay. For example, the user can you know search for gender and also for religion and also for other fields and they can combine each one of the queries it it is more complex so please do the create and modify first and uh, you, you can put that on your recap to do list okay okay so with flexibility and combining it okay yeah sorry. but with with more flexibility mm. Flexibility. As in in MongoDB, it's possible to use n, so you can like stack multiple criteria. Oh, okay, okay. But okay. yeah, the, log the logic will be um, quite yeah complex. Yeah. Okay. All right. So we are on the end of the meeting. Ah, hello, Kevin.